Hi, and welcome to the Hoop Scoop. Please like and subscribe on your way in. The transfer portal, a pivotal period that significantly impacts the landscape of college basketball, officially closed on Wednesday, May 1st. In this video, we will delve into the portal's winners and losers, last minute signings, and notable players who are still in the portal. To start, let's list the latest commitments and pivot to the winners and losers of the portal. Coming to the Pac-12 is Tamia Gardner. She's a six foot three forward. She's a sophomore scoring 11.6 points per game and seven rebounds per game. She's leaving Oregon State and heading to UCLA. Also coming to the Pac-12 is Deja Kelly. She's a five foot eight guard. She is a senior. She's scoring 16.3 points per game, 3.9 rebounds and 3.2 assists. She is coming from North Carolina and transferring to Oregon. Coming to the SEC, we have Jordan Obi, six foot one forward. She's a senior, scoring 14.8 points per game and 7.7 .7 rebounds per game. She is leaving University of Pennsylvania and heading to Kentucky. Also for the SEC is Taryn Ward. She's a five foot eleven guard. She is a senior. She scores 22 points per game, 9.1 rebounds per game. She is leaving Georgia Southern and heading to Mississippi State. Coming to the ACC, we have Liza Carlin. She is a six foot two forward. She is a senior, scoring 17.7 .7 points per game and 7.9 rebounds per game. She is leaving Marquette and heading to Notre Dame. Also, we have Latu King. She is a six foot guard. She is a senior, scoring 18.7 points per game and 10.3 rebounds per game. She is leaving Pittsburgh and heading to Notre Dame. Now let's talk winners and losers. USC signing of the number one ranked transfer portal player Kiki Ariafin and the number 10 ranked Talia von Allhofen to play alongside Juju Watkins has to be the biggest winner of the portal. In that same breath, South Carolina Gamecocks lost the Kiki sweepstakes to USC along with not landing any top 20 portal players, making them a loser in the portal sweepstakes. That being said, South Carolina is returning all but one player from their undefeated season, a significant piece, center Camila Cardosa. Oklahoma was able to sign number two ranked six foot four forward, sophomore Regan Beers over UConn and Gino Ariyama in making Oklahoma a portal winner. UConn was able to sign a fifth year senior and ninth ranked five foot nine guard, Caitlin Chen will help relieve Paige's pressure not securing beers to fill the void left by Edwards, who was drafted by Washington, makes them a winner. LSU was one of the biggest winners of the portal sweepstakes, even after losing so many players, including Angel Reese to the draft and three others, including Haley Van Litt. However, LSU was able to sign four bigger, more productive and more experienced replacement players. Jersey Wolfenbarger, 19th ranked Cheyenne Day Wilson, Miracle Shepherd and Kaylin Gilbert. Another school that made out like bandits was TCU, signing a plethora of guards, including LSU transfer 14th ranked Haley Van Lith and 23rd ranked Maddie Shear. Iowa is also a winner for signing a scoring guard in Lucy Olson, who should be able to fill some of the scoring void left by Caitlin Clark, who was drafted number one overall by the Indiana Fever. UCLA, another big winner being able to secure the fourth ranked Charlie Sledger Walker at 5'10 and sixth ranked Tamia Gardner. Kentucky got third ranked Georgia Amore after signing Brooks as their head coach. Notre Dame scored a huge win with two late signings of Liza Carlin and number 16 Laitu King who will play alongside Hannah Hildago after the portal closed, making Notre Dame a big portal winner. The biggest loser has to be Oregon State, which lost eight of its players to the transfer portal, three of which are ranked in the top 10. Donovan Hunter, number 10, Talia Van Alhoffen, number six, Tamia Gardner, and number two, Reagan Beers. Other notable names, Katari Poole, 5'8 guard, senior, 
scoring 4.5 points per game, is heading to Houston. Also, Angelica Velez, 5'7 guard, is leaving LSU and heading to Syracuse. Donovan Hunter, 6'0 guard, freshman, scoring 6.8 points per game, 3.7 assists per game, is leaving Oregon State and heading to TCU. And Paulina Paris, a 5'9 guard, sophomore, scoring 5.9 points per game, is leaving North Carolina and heading to Arizona. There are still quality uncommitted players still in the portal, such as 12th ranked Janiah Barker. She's six foot four forward, sophomore, scoring 12.2 points per game and 7.6 rebounds. Alexis Andrews, five foot eight, guard. She's a sophomore, scoring 12.5 points per game, 3.9 rebounds per game. This concludes our portal reporting. You guys have responded dramatically to this video series and we just want to thank you. Stay tuned for more great content. As always, comment, like, and subscribe to help us grow the channel. See you in the next video.